All right, everyone. Welcome to yet another edition of our awesome Hall of Healers interview, where we document the transformation of our clients and the kind of impact they have had in their life after the transformation in their health. So today I have with me a special guest, you know, a scientific star for Ashok, who is working in a government organization, having long work hours. Uh, and today we are going to document his journey of health transformation. So what I want you to do right now is watch this video fully and uh, let's hear about Ashok's transformation. And I want you to get inspired and start your health journey, right? So Ashok, welcome to the Hall of Healers. Yeah. Hi. Yes. Thank you, Sachin. Amazing. So Ashok, I want to understand from you, let's begin this interview by understanding, you know, what's the nature of your work like? So is it very stressful? Uh, do you ever have to work long hours? Yeah. Uh, hi, Howell. Myself, I'm Ashok. I'm working in a central government organization as a scientific staff. And uh, being in R&D, research and development, it will be more tedious work because it's a part of an uh, academic also. So we need to look after the students, the trainees who come under uh, our organization for their projects and all. So we have to help them also. So meantime, it's like more uh, stress in the sense, we are, most students, they come, they, they come and go, and the instruments we need to take very uh, cautiously, we have to use it. Got it. Uh, that's the reason it should be more stressful. Mm. So I understand that your nature of work is stressful and uh, being in a central government organization. I got that, Ashok. So right now I want to understand from you, Ashok, that you know what were the main challenges you were facing in your health, you know, both physical and mental, before joining the self-healing challenge? Uh, for me, it was like anxiety and stress were the major factors. Okay. Okay. Anxiety and stress. Did I hear you correctly? I had to, I had to overcome from these two uh, main aspects in my life. Mm. That was the main motor for me. Mm. Because of that, I could not uh, concentrate on other uh, interest that was under uh, academic point of view. Got you. So this anxiety and stress, right, Ashok? So how long you, you were facing this issue? From how long you're facing these issues? Since a decade. Since a decade, from 10 years. Okay. Got you. So Ashok, like I want to understand, right? You look at many ads in social media, you come across many articles, information, uh, but what made you choose self-healers hub and self-healing challenge? What made you trust this coaching? Uh, frankly speaking, it was uh, one of my close friends, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. uh, Dr. Sushma. Okay. She was the one uh, who just, uh, just made a contact that uh, Sachin, we can, um, we can go do better for you. Mm. So I thought of just opting for, for it. And mm. it was, it worked awesome for me. Yeah, that's why I understand, you know. There. Yeah, you know, one life helping other another one and uh, that being transformed. So, you know, because your friend trusted uh, me, you trusted me. Am I right in understanding? That? Yes, yes. No, I got that. I got that, Ashok, okay. So I want to like understand from you, Ashok, you know, you said anxiety and stress were your major problems, uh, you know, facing it from la a decade. So what were the transformations, you know, you saw after, you know, implementing what I shared with you in the, you know, the self-healing challenge. So what are the transformations you began to see in yourself? Uh, transformation in the sense, earlier it was like more anxious. Then mm -hmm. now I, uh, it's like how to overcome mm -hmm. what I've learned it mm -hmm. using a 3C challenge, 3C motto, like a mm -hmm. challenge, control and commitment. Mm -hmm. I'm not uh, bothering on uh, going on to other, other business and all. Mm -hmm. Whatever they think, let them, let them think. Don't uh, take, take, it to, uh, take it on your head and all. That was the main mm -hmm. motto for me. Now also, just I'm continuing it. It's working, but it's, it's working uh, good for me right now. Got, got you. And what are the other, uh, you know, transformations or the, if you want to say like, what are the other areas of your life which started getting more positive after, you know, your anxiety and stress reduced? Uh, 
I started enjoying at my workplace. Okay. Okay. And uh, creativity increased a lot. Very good. Okay. Awesome. And I, I need to some. I need to balance it. Mm hmm. Got it. So you learn. So you learn how to balance work and life, is it? Yes. All right, and uh, you were able to increase your creativity, mm. right? And uh, you were able to then go ahead and uh, get more peaceful. Am I right in understanding? Peaceful or in the sense, I have to start meditating. Okay, that so, was good. So you started meditating as well, right? So, so right now you started having more peace in your life. So, how did that affect your like relationships? Uh, having inner peace is the main uh, mantra. If this, if your inner peace is very good, then uh, the outside environment will also be very good. Mm. The positive vibes will be there around you, so that then the workplace will be very happy, mm. and uh, the creativity will increase. There will be like a chain. It's like a chain reaction. It mm. goes on. so like a chain reaction right so you reduced your stress and anxiety which you are facing for over a decade uh, so did that result in more happiness in your life asho yes more happiness it comes with the family also with the friends mm is there so you told you started meditating you started following 3c model which i which we discussed and so how were the you know one on one sessions for you did you find it valuable ah uh, sessions was very good Sessions were each and uh, each and every session was like was like quite different. Mm -hmm. uh, thinking the different angle point of view was very different. All right. Mm. Like so, uh, food habit, it was okay. different. All right. So I uh, I started totally change the food diet diet control also diet. Mm -hmm. All right. So it was like okay one of them. So Ashok, you said you changed your diet, correct? so the diet part was it very restrictive for you or were you able to eat your like favorite food sometimes and also eat your uh, the foods which are good for you so was the diet which you started practicing restrictive or not restrictive it was not it was uh, restricting as such mm -hmm. i okay. was taking gradually gradually right yeah. so you, you were still able to like eat your uh, you know favorite foods once in a while and also yeah, yeah right so that's very good right like if you look out there it's more of a restrictive diets right so you were now you were able to do that so what was the impact on your you know digestive health ashok because of more happiness reduced anxiety and stress how how did your digestive health improve as well digestion it has improved a lot it has it's improved not, there's no issue why why is that hmm so you your digestion and metabolism also started improving because you are happier and anxiety yes. reduced so ashok clearly i can see there are a lot of you know increased uh, transformations for you right so you felt more focused you felt peaceful your anxiety and stress reduced you started meditating more you know happiness at work happiness in life yes. happiness in relationship more metabolism and you started taking uh, gradual foods changed your food habits according to your body type and uh, have a sense of non restriction towards food so your relationship also changed right so ashok how much time did you need to you know bring these much transformation into your life the one to one was uh, because of one to one i was able to transform it mhm mm mhm mm because ahead. of the uh, lack of time i was not uh, able to join the group session also group calls also i just missed it mhm mm So they yeah, want to help me. Yeah, I got you, Ashok. So how long did it take? How much time did it take for you to start seeing these results? Uh, six months. Six months. Okay. So you are saying like uh, the decade of ten years of challenges, you are able to slowly start completely transforming that in a matter of six months. Six am months. I, am yes. Right? So focused effort for six months. you know and accountability helped you overcome this 10 years of challenge am i right yes fantastic ashok that's a big win right so i ask you this question ashok like so do you have the confidence right now 
that you will be able to you know sustain these changes you know for your whole life yeah 100% mm that's very confident 100% i really like that awesome so ashok i really acknowledge you for taking that coaching and you know i really acknowledge you for taking a beautiful actions right and actually turning around this 10 years of stress and anxiety and right now finding that inner peace which is always yours right and yes. you did it in just a matter of 6 months 6 months this is fantastic ashok right so i want to ask you ashok what was the one you know uh, thing which really stood out for you because i why i asked this question is there are many many people who feel like oh i can't do this or they may feel like i don't have enough time or i don't have enough uh, money to invest on my health they may feel these challenges right so what is the one thing which is like your success mantra or the health mantra which has stuck into your mind and you will use it for you know your whole life success mantra is like uh stay focused on your life mm-hmm. there should be no any um, don't take any men- mentally mm-hmm. uh, stubborn mm-hmm. then don't take any problems on your head so that it will affect on your uh, subconscious mind also <laughs> got it that's the main uh, uh, mantra i can just got it tell so, to others so staying focused is one thing second is uh, you know solving the problems not taking it stress stressing yourself out and not burning yourself out and uh, so that you have that inner peace correct yeah fantastic ashok that was a really great message right so ashok i really acknowledge you again for the kind of actions you have taken and as you said 100% you are able to sustain that so i'm wishing you more health more wealth more happiness love and peace and uh, people who are watching this video there's a link in the description of this video where you can click the link and you know book a consultation call with me where we can have a chat about your health all right so ashok yeah thanks a lot for uh, sharing your transformation journey right and uh, be healthy be happy and be unique all right yeah sure it's the same thank you yes yeah. see you.